Okay, and we're back. Um, yeah, yeah, lot, lots has happened right now. Uh, need more energy in the power station, not gonna lie. Maybe it's because we need to switch these on. I don't know. Okay, we just need more capacitors. Something's going on here. However, we have made our holding cell. It's going fairly well. It's always always nice to see. But now we need to make sort of the, the exit. Uh, I believe the prison should go down in this direction, then it'll build around here later on. So what we'll do is we'll make another object being the, uh, what am I looking at? Ja j jail door, jar door, it's definitely what I was going to say there, definitely. And um, we'll have it hmm, here. Looks like a good place for it, but I think having it down here, it's not symmetrical, unfortunately, which drives me crazy. We'll have it there. That's a good place for it. And then we will have a wall built up here. Just because it would look good. That's pretty much it. <laughs> and it will go down here, and there will be a... Should we have some walls, some windows, I mean, connected to there? Is it objects? Yeah, window, large window right there. Yeah, there we go. That'll look nice. Alrighty then, lots is happening right now. Now we just need to move down here and start constructing our jail cells. Let's take some water. Just take it! Mm. There we go. Oh, it looks like the, the light actually goes outside when you have windows. It's pretty nice to see. Some garbage there for some reason. It's always nice to look at. And now we're going to start constructing our actual prison. Now we do need roads. And I feel like I have like sort of a yard system where... Well, we need a fence down here actually to guard off this uh, rubbish. What we might do is have a... What do we want around here? <laughs> what do we want? I mean, a large jail door doesn't make sense really. I mean, maybe a small jail gate. That'll be the way they get into this rubbish area. Yeah, it makes sense. What we'll have is we'll have a jail door here that can open up there. And then what we'll do is we'll make gates that connects to the next building, which is like a surrounded area which has a yard in the center and that lot going to be very safe, very secure, trust me. There we are. I feel like it needs to go a bit further as well because I want the yard around here and I want them to be like be seen. Seen by the prey. Yes, that's definitely what's happening right there. There we are. And then they'll go on into the yard. And the yard will go off about here. There we are. That's a good place for a yard. Uh, we'll have the fencing go off there. We'll have the yard here, and then it'll be surrounded by jail cells, and more jail cells will happen there. Uh, sounds like a good idea. Alright then, so. There's confinement, uh, the holding cells. Now we just need to find the room that is the yard. There we are. I really wish it would show me where my last selection was for my materials. It's, uh, what? One, two, three, four down. So around about here. That's I've completely lost it again. Well, we'll let them build it. Yeah, that's a better idea. There we go. Get a little bit of cash flow in there as well. Nice to see. The more prisons you have, the more money you get as well. There's lots of moss growing around these fences. It's a bit weird to see. That's really weird to see, actually. It's a bit weird to look at. There we are, and then we'll have a, well, I guess we'll have a large gate as well. Large window, large gate. There we are. That guy just, like, pulled a gate out of his pocket. That was pretty amazing to look at. I think that works. I guess what we'll have is we'll, uh, you know what, we'll get rid of that and that. And we'll make them concrete walls. There we are. That's much better. And then I guess we'll have uh, concrete walls going around. Yeah, would we? I guess not. Uh, it's getting quite dark now, actually. We need to stop the time a bit there. We had it rushed off a bit too much. 
And now we need to make this yard. And I'll have it go along here. 20 by 20. Is that too big for a yard? Yeah, it is a bit too big. Like maybe 18, 15 by 15. See, that's then awkward. Like we need it to be sort of symmetrical. That looks like a decent size for a yard, but at the same time, it's too big again. It does have to be perfect. We can be like 15 by 15 here. That's a decent size for a yard. And then obviously we can use these extra little bits here. There we are. It's a bit random, but, you know, yard to yard. So, now we need to make some walls. Concrete walls going around this area. Hmm. Actually, not concrete walls. It would have to be fences still. Uh, but just up this bit. Well, actually, we're still surrounded, surrounding it with uh, buildings and that lot, so I guess it still works. So what we'll do is we'll make some concrete walls along here. And then that'll go off into another building here. It's going to be pretty long, though, because it's going to be like proper jail sort of cell area. What's that? Six across? 21 there? That should be six. No, that's five. That's a bit awkward. There we are. And that's about that. That's That works. There we go. And that'll be the jail cell area. Everyone, get to work on that. It's going to take a little while to get all that built up. It's very dark as well, which doesn't help. But it's fine. We have the best builders in the world. They can build entire buildings in seconds. It's amazing. I think here... Should really be the kitchen, but... Oh, well. Um, pause for a second there, because we need the doors, don't we? Uh, rooms. Nope, objects, I mean. Large jail door. We're going to have one right here. Actually, we'll have one on the far side here. And then we'll do the same on this side. And it's not connected to the wall, is it? No, it's not. So it goes up by one. There we are. And we're going to need that to be powered up as well. So let's go and get some uh, cables running along. And we need some water pipes as well to run along here. There we are. It's going to take a little while to get that set up. It's going places though. It's getting there. It's prison is starting to become a beautiful thing. Do need more power though, and I don't like how these gates are open all the time. It doesn't help out. Oh well. This should be an actual room by now. I'm not too sure why it's taking them so long. Wait, what's this all about? Oh, there we go. So they just need to make the door down there. The light's coming back on, though. Well, the lights are coming on. That's always good to see. We still need some lights around this area. And we need a path as well along here. Very expensive, but we'll just have our crappy paving stones. Or should we have, like, gravel? Let's have gravel. Yeah. That's always good to see. Bit of gravel there. We still... Oh, no. There, there is a door there. The door's going to be clocked for the most part. There we are. All that gravel. Beautiful. Okay, then. Now we need to make the cells. We've only got two hours left, but that's why we've got a holding cell. All right. Now, rooms... How big does a cell need to be? Uh, two by three. Okay, then. So that's not bad. We just like two by three is about that, isn't it? Yeah, okay. 
It's not a bad size for a cell. I can work with that. What we can do is have it go along this way instead. That works out because then the walls would also sort of be very easily made. So what we'll do is we will go to materials, go to these walls, and basically do this. There we are. And this person's got a pretty big... Actually, I don't really want to give them a big room. The thing is, I actually don't want this to be a cell. I want this to be something else. So we'll see what we can do with that. Let's free, free there again. And one more. There we are. So that's a bit awkward looking, I'm not going to lie. It's not aligned very well. That's fine. We have uh, eight cells, which is what we need for eight prisoners. And then we can obviously like duplicate it on the other side and work around it later on. Uh, objects right now, though, include small jail doors. Very expensive. But yeah, and we'll have it on this side on all of them. Uh, and uh, the same here. There we are. And now the jail doors require beds. Well, the jails require beds. And they need to be along like this. Bed, 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 bed. It's not they're pretty good beds. I'd give them, like, something completely worse than what they're being given now. Can't provide them anything worse, though. Justice system, man. There we are. And now we need a toilet here. There we are. Anything else? I don't think they need anything else. They're prisoners. All they require is a bed toilet. I would make uh, outdoors for them, but I don't think I'm going to do that. Outdoors for them. I mean, I'm gonna, I'll, I'll make something, okay? I'll definitely do something. Uh, we need showers is what we need next. Um, so what we'll do is we'll have this just be... We could have it be a recreation area. I'm not too sure. We'll worry about it later. We'll worry about it later. There's lots to do right now. Lots to think about. Lots to be done. Okay. Now we just need to... These concrete walls, they look really weird. Like, they look really cool, but they just don't work with this wall right here. Uh, yeah, so we need a shower. We could have the shower, like, dead on in the center here. So that when they walk out, they're all freezing and that lot. God, I'm trying to torture him in this place. Am I a great warden or not? You tell me. Uh, we need the officers down here, actually. And actually, do we want it down there or a bit safer? I think down here is probably a better place for them. We'll work on that. But for now, we shall have a shower. And I think, actually, I can have the shower here. It's not a bad place for the shower. If we build open, if we build open a little bit more here. Then we can have a shower. So let's get a brick wall. And how big does a shower need to be? Let's find out. Shower. Doesn't have really, it doesn't have any uh, estimated space required. So what we'll do is uh, we'll do four, five down there. And then number five here. And that is a decent space for a shower. Now what we do is we get some doors. Do we want some big jail doors or some small ones? A lot of people will be commuting into here in the morning, so I think we need some big doors. Actually, do we want any doors? Like, not really. I don't actually want any doors here. I just want to destroy these areas, to be honest. What we'll do is we'll put a light in here. Actually, I think it needs to be a bit bigger for a shower room. It does. It's a bit small. So what we'll do is we'll get some uh, brick walls here. Cover that up. Six down, six there. It's a little bit bigger, but it, it helps. It's always good to see. And now we can actually... Well, like, we should let them build stuff here first while we're mucking about with this. Got the prisoners coming soon enough. I want to see what their names are. I want to start calling them stuff. Prisoner intake, two hours time. Come on, guys. Let's build up. Chop, chop. Let's get this done. We built a prison in less than a day. Or at least kind of half a prison. Kind of. <laughs> So yeah, uh, white tiles here as well. 
Well, when it's actually been set as a wall room, I guess. Beautiful. Hopefully this actually has built up like a, a building, I guess. I should probably do that instead. It'll probably work better. You can hear all this like whoop, whoop sounds. It's really cool. Awesome. There we are. They're building the uh, the foundations for this area. Oh, prisoners are here. Where's the uh, guard? Okay, so we need more guards. By the looks of it, because now all the doors have stopped and they need guards to open them. Let's have uh, two more guards. Ah, eh, three more guards, why not? Feed all prisoners, okay then. There we are, welcome prisoners. We have uh, Locke. He's got his own, like, sort of. Wow, they've got their own. Like. Oh, they've got the bio. And then they got all this stuff here. Experience. Grading. Punishment, 10. How well the prisoner has been punished for his crimes. He's been punished pretty hard. Um, reform, though. Uh, Grant of how well you have attempted to reform and rehabilitate the prisoner through the use of reform programs. Well, like, become this person. Security, level 5. The grain represents how well you have kept this prisoner safely locked away, keeping... So this is all what they've been given so far? I don't... Okay. And their health. It's a pretty big lad, not gonna lie. One active addiction. Okay, then. So food or something. And then it's the same for all these guys. This guy wants freedom. They all want freedom. One of them wants sleep, though. You're gonna have your own sleep, but later on, good sir. There's so many options. <laughs> Convictions. Manslaughter. 15 years. Wow. Well, okay. Driving under the influence. He served two of those. He served 14 years. But yeah, he still thought, ah, oh, you know what would be fun? Manslaughter. Let's go for that. It's going to be cool actually to see when they sort of fulfill their entire time if the prison actually lasts that long. I'm not too sure what the day well I guess it's just day two so really it's going to be a long time before they actually fulfill their duties but some of them will. Some of them be here for life really though. 15 years kind of like for life in this game I guess. Some of these people you have to keep an eye on. I imagine some of them. So all of these are just like this is what I've done with them so far. Okay then. That guy's 62. Doesn't look like he's 62. Simon we got uh, we got Simon, we got Joins, we got some guy here, uh, Tom, we got um, the Inquisitor, Adam Cena, I'm not too sure, just Adam the Inquisitor, Ed, Ed Miller, uh, Wesley, Care Bear Wesley, okay, Care Bear, he's called the Care Bear. Hopefully they do start gaining some reputation in that. Well, that'd be quite fun to watch. There we are. You got run over. Okay, prisoners get in the holding cell. Are they actually going to go in the holding cell? Okay, they're grabbing prisoners and shoving them in the holding cell. Okay, it's good to see. While their uh, homes are being created. Oh, yeah, look. The entire building's being created there. And that's the uh, showers. So what we need is more walls along here. Two here, two there. Bit awkward, isn't it? But oh well. Hearing all these waka woo sounds, weird. Waka woo sounds. Um, definitely what I was meant to say there. I'm not great with my blocks. Okay, my symmetry is awful. I understand this. I fully understand this. 
Oh, well, they're sending everyone to the holding cell. That's good to see. And uh, now we just need the showers to be done. Uh, apparently, we need, like, grating in that lot as well with the showers. So, where do we get... Where's that? Um, white tiles is what we need, I think, here. There we are. Get some white tiles. Uh, so, I can't... It's probably around here. Ah, oh, yeah, drain. There we go. And we put the drain here and here. And that way it can't actually get out. And we'll put a drain here and one here as well, just in case. And that should be fine. That should work out. And now we just need showers. So a few showers should uh, suffice. We just need to find where the shower is first. That's a sprinkler. Oh, it automatically sprays the area of water in the event of a fire. I'm not looking forward to the first fire, I'm not going to lie. Metal detector. That's pretty interesting. If we have like a metal detector before they go through this gate, that would work out. But then we have a pretty crappy system. But it would help us out if people are going to bring in some contraband. I'm looking forward to that. I'm looking forward to it. Um, important when it comes to contraband. Well then. Uh, staff door. Not just guards. Okay, that helps out. I'm still looking for shower. It might be... Oh, there it is. Shower head. Okay, I'm really bad at looking. I look everywhere but the thing I'm looking for. Right, so I have one here, one here, and then one there, one there, and one there. And that works out fairly well. I have another one along here as well, just 